Hello and welcome to Window Cleaning Resource on YouTube. Are you drooling at the sight of these lovely fine tools? Well stay tuned to find out how you can win them all. Thanks for watching windowcleaner.com. Make sure to give us a thumbs up and subscribe. Hello, I'm Trad Man. We've got a lovely Trad Girl joining us today. Thank you very much. So today we're going to be running through some of the items that I use on a day-to-day -day basis. We're going to be running through what they are, what they do, and uh, why I use them. So, first up, I'll just pass this along to my lovely assistant. So we have the Mormon bucket here, with a nice ergonomic handle. It's a very light bucket. The reason I quite like this bucket is it's got little gauges inside that tells you exactly how many litres or US gallons. It's got both of those markers on it on the inside. So it lets you know exactly how much you uh, need or want to use. So a very handy bucket there. It accommodates most sizes of applicators and squeegees. So next up, we've got the brand new Mormon snapper handle complete with the 14 and 10 inch liquidator 2.0 channels. Lovely packaging there as well. So it's a very, very nice uh, tool. I really like this one. It's got a 35 degree angle on the, uh, the handle there, which is handy for sort of deep sills and frames and things like that. It's got a quick release button, which makes obviously getting the channels in and out of that handle much easier as well, rather than the spring loaded mechanism. So that's the Mormon snapper handle with the two liquidator channels there, very good in hand work. So that's that. We've also then got the Mormon Squeeze Deluxe, which is just in this little bottle here. Now, it's, this is the professional dish soap, basically, from Mormon. Now, it's a very nice dish soap to use. It's got the blue end cap there, which stops any residue coming out when the bottle's tipped upside down. So you actually have to squeeze the bottle to get the, uh, the, the dish soap to come out. So, it's very good. We've got the Mormon bucket on a belt here. Now, it accommodates two squeegees and also one applicator. It has the quick release mechanism at the top, so the receiving end attaches to your belt, and you've got that little clip there which clips into it, so you nice and quickly can get that bucket on a belt on and off during your day. The next thing we've got is the Mormon accelerator, complete with a 10-inch uh, liquidator channel, the 2.0, and the 10-inch flick pad. Very good tool, very, very good tool. It features a swivel mechanism. It also features the fixed mechanism, whether you like to use it in that mode. It, I would recommend using it in swivel on a pole. It also has angle changing adjustment, so it's got a big blue button on the side, which allows the handle to change from 10 degrees, 25 degrees, and 40 degrees. So it's very, very good. Next up, we've got the Mormon pole here, aluminium pole. This is a 16-foot pole, complete with the Mormon end locking cone. It's very handy. You can usually do things with ground floor and up to first floor work is normally what I do with this pole. It reaches no problem at all. And also, like I say, with the end locking cone, which fits nicely with any of the Mormon handles there, clicks nice and securely, especially if you're doing, obviously, pole work. You want it to make sure that it's not going to spin, it's not going to come off at any point, so that's very good. Anyway, so... Yes, so we've got the end locking cone there that uh, holds the Mormon accelerator on securely. Next up, we've got the Mormon 14 inch T bar and the 14 inch sleeve. Now, the 14 inch sleeve, I would say, is one of the best sleeves on the market. The amount of water that this can retain is amazing. It's really, really good and uh, nice ergonomic handle there as well. Next up, we've got the Mormon scraper, which has got a nice feature where you can turn this dial and the red section goes up and down, which reveals the blade and hides the blade. So it basically saves having a cap on the uh, on this scraper there. Uh, you can just obviously use the dial to, uh, to reveal the blade. That's also very good. We've got the Mormon scrapers uh, blades there complete in the wee packet. So it's very handy as well. And finally, we've got the Mormon side kit. Absolutely love this pouch. Reasons being, First up, we've got the Mormon bottle holder section here, which is great for your Mormon Squeeze Deluxe. Use that all the time. Very, very handy. I wish all uh, pouches had that. On the front, we've got a magnetic, we've got a magnetic flap there, which is very, very good for holding your keys and phones, anything like that. Very, very good. Next section inside the black section is a water resistant section, so you keep your wet cloths and all that kind of stuff in there. It's really, really good. 
followed by in the next section where I usually keep dry cloths and things like that. Uh, so it's really good as well. And finally on the back, we've got this zipper section. So I use that for keeping any spare money, things like that, loose things that I don't want to lose. So very, very handy. And these clips on the top are here, very good as well. Your belt feeds through these holes. And if you need to, you can take off this uh, Mormon side kit at any point and leave the receiving end still attached to your trad belt. So in my opinion, this is the best side kit or pouch for traditional use I think I've ever used on the market. So these are things that I use on a daily basis. So thank you ever so much uh, Trad Girl for your assistance today. That's much appreciated, thank you. Now guys, a little golden nugget at the end of the video. If you've stayed this long, you're gonna thank me. So we're gonna be giving all of this kind of stuff but brand new away, okay? Yes, and no, I'm not getting it. <laughs> okay, so th thank you to Window Clean Resource. Your one lucky winner is going to receive these items brand new. Okay, so one winner is going to be picked at random. Okay, and the winner will be announced in one week's time on Window Cleaning Resources Facebook page. But to enter, you have to be subscribed to Window Cleaning Resources YouTube page, and also be subscribed to me. Or should I say us? <laughs> Subscribe to us uh, on uh, our YouTube page as well. So that's Tradman. Okay, all the details will be in the description below for you guys. So if you want to enter, remember to like, comment uh, on the video, be subscribed to Window Cleaning Resource, be subscribed to Tradman on YouTube, and we'll announce the winner one week's time on Window Cleaning Resource's Facebook page. Okay, thank you very much for watching. You have been watching Tradman and Trad Girl and we've been talking about the Mormon tools today. Thank you very much, be good, take care, and I'll see you squeegee slingers next time. Bye for now. Bye. Thanks for watching windowcleaner.com on YouTube. If you liked the video, please thumbs up and subscribe. And make sure to check back every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday so you don't miss a video. And if you tear up at just the thought of not having Tradman for a whole week, check out his channel, Tradman, on YouTube. It's nice and securely, especially if you're doing obviously pole work, you want it to make sure that it's not going to spin, it's not going to come off at any point, so that's very good. I can't make it work. Peek at <laughs> Amateur. Aaron, see the amateur here? You have to cut this bit out. A <laughs> <laughs> uh, little... What? <laughs> what do I call it, Aaron? A magnetic what? <laughs> Flap. Flat, we'll go for flat, right, edit them out. <laughs>